Hi guys, I'm just excited for this fight that's about to um, come to fruition next week. Um, I know a lot of you are upset that I've chose Regis to win, but a lot of you think Regis is just a brawler, but he's, he's far from that. I want you to watch this attack. Watch Regis after he, watch Regis' opponent after he lands the body shot. He thinks another body shot's coming. Watch the jab. Beautiful. You know, one thing I don't like is fighters. A lot of fighters you train, um, you you train them. You tell them a specific drill to do, and they'll go and they'll do the drill. But they're in in between the drill. They start doing anything they want to do. Those fighters will never learn. Um, and this is what I like about Regis. He sticks to that drill, he works on that, he works on his craft, and he's an expert at coming inside. He can fight on the inside, he can fight on the outside. He's he's got he's got great timing, and he's he's able to uh, change rhythm. Um, and the power at one forty is brilliant. Another thing I want you to watch his jab. Now, a lot of you think that Taylor's got a better jab than Regis, um, and I just can't see it. Taylor's got one jab, and he and Regis has three variations of the jab, the way he comes in, um, and he breaks the jab up as well, never at the same speed. The, did you see that? Did you see that? The, not only did he make, make him missed... Just his change in, in speed. Rhythm breaker. A great jab. And I think... If he wants to, he, he could box at range. But I really think that he's going to come to the UK and r try and knock out Josh Taylor. And he has to. Because I believe it's in the UK. Sky Sports will be biased. Even though it's in the UK... Scotland's near, they're going to have a favouritism, so Regis is going to have to come out here and um, put on a show, and the, he's got many ways to get inside. Um, at some point, Josh Josh Taylor, even if, just, just say for instance, Josh Taylor is outboxing him, which I don't think he will, at some point in the fight, it's going to become a dogfight. Then, then we're going to truly see what what Taylor's um, chin's made of. I know he was hit. He was hit with a lot of shots from Branchek, and it, and it, it bothered him from round six to ten. You watch. Now I know Taylor could have just kept on the outside and carried on boxing, but Regis has got a few dimensions in that he he can box with Taylor. What happens if Regis goes out there and decides to box at range? And Taylor, and he's outboxing Taylor because it can happen. Regardless of what a lot of you think, if that happens, then Taylor's gonna have to make it a wall. And I believe Regis has got more dog in him. Um, we're gonna find out. Either way, we're gonna find out who's what type of level each person's on. Um, the best will come out of both of these fighters in this fight. I just believe Regis is this is his coming out party, guys. No disrespect. Um, 